latest trading system results for one of our top trading strategies. V reversal has been one of our top trading strategies and it has had about five losing trade. The last five trades have been losers. Market's been very divergent. It took out the weekly lows on Wednesday, then it turned around and gapped up yesterday, gapped up, took out uh, last week's last week's lows on Wednesday, uh, last week's highs today. So what will it do next? Um, you know, I guess it could run up again because there's a bias to the upside, but it could also likely mean revert and it is short today. So we'll see how these results turn out. But let's look at the long term performance for this setup. Here is the equity curve with slippage and commission. And so you can see um, the equity curve cycles. You have um, basically a trend line in this equity curve that looks kind of like this. And so what looks like when you look historically at this, these drawdowns look small when you trade them. Sometimes they feel bigger. And so you, one of the things that's easy to do when you're trading is to jump in at equity peaks. Um, what I encourage is to start on drawdowns. If you're not trading something, trade it starting on a drawdown versus at an equity peak. And if you also want to add positions, you want to add positions on drawdowns and then tighten up your risk if it breaks that trend line in the equity curve. And so that is one thing to look at. And, um, you know, you can see the market today. It's uh, determined to go higher but at the same time we have the election coming up so it's also been choppy lately and this is a good short trade we'll see if it works out liquidity gapped up the last two days run it up today look like it would be a 500 point rally on the Nasdaq today but when you see what it's done you see what the, what the Nasdaq has done uh, this week taking out the lows on Wednesday of last week's lows on Wednesday and then taking out uh, the highs of last week today it makes sense that it's just a mean reverting market and this is um, not as big of a move as it seems and so the market I do believe will have some uh, some favorable price actions between now and the election uh, but mostly choppy with the occasional trend and the chop strategies that we have do take advantage of these type of market environments and I look forward to seeing how V reversal does at the end of the day this is Friday around noon Eastern time that we're making this video so we'll see if this hits its profit target it is short from let's see it's short at this 662 20 662 25 the profit target is 25 62 50 down here at this level and so just a little bit of a give back will give us our profit target on the day. Could also potentially reverse the long side. So if it sells off um, a little bit more and then it reverses higher, the more, it could take an, a long trade as well. It could reverse to the long side. It could hit its profit target and go to the long side. Or you know if it rallies, it could get stopped out. So that is um, that is the V reversal combo that we've been looking for. You have to look at the long term results and the trend line of the equity curve. To really get a strong feel um, for what what to do and when to trade it and how to manage your risk. Hey, David Bean here. Welcome to Capstone Trading Systems YouTube page. Be sure to subscribe to join our community of algorithmic traders. We are real money traders. We share our winning streaks, we share our losing streaks, as well as market updates, strategies, and coding tips.